to check the firmware version on the Firestorm TX1 remote control, um, we need to put it into its factory test mode. This is really easy. You just turn the remote control on while holding the up arrow. So I'm going to hold the up arrow, press and hold the power button, and the remote will turn on. You can let go of the buttons. You'll see that all the display and all the lights are on, and the battery level light will begin to flash out as normal. So you can just check that all of the lights work. You should get green and yellow here, red, and then all the displays on. You can press any button, and you'll then see the firmware version. This is the important bit you'll probably want to check. This is on version 2.2. You can then press any button again, and we'll do a quick button check. So button one, starting at the top left, you press, and then it says button two, you press, button three, press, four, press, five, press, six, press. If everything's okay, the display will show PA for pass. That means that we've passed the basic self-test. You can then press any button, and the remote will reboot and just return to normal operation.